Hello, welcome. We see we have some new changes in the game today. Version 1.3.9, right front and center. A uh, patch for this week. We can see that they are slightly changing the experience gain from experience drinks. Normal advance are staying the same. They are increasing the experience from super EXP from 8 to 9. And decreasing Mega down from 64 to 27. So that's a very big decrease. Um, one thing I do want to say is make sure you're using those Super EXPs before the update. So that you can get maximum value out of them. I personally don't think I have any. Uh, just going to double check. Nope. I don't have any. So nothing for me to worry about. But that's just a quick patch update. Uh, no new items in the game like the last patch. Adding the 10 play games. They added the Super EXP. Um, all that good stuff. But I'm just going to take a look at my bench real quick. Alrighty. But yeah, nothing too much going on. Just going to jump into game today. I uh, got some content lined up later on, maybe next week. And yeah, it's a really chill weekday game. Went through the patch. Nothing to say. I do want to clarify last week when I was talking about trying not to buy items off of the store. Somebody did mention that, yes, if you buy the player pack, your players are silver, not bronze, which is what they are when you first recruit them. But even then, uh, you know, it's it's probably cheaper that way than buying all the silver badges and the recruit tickets and the coins to use the silver badges. But it's just not, it's not worth it. $30. Go buy yourself a console game, you know. Go get yourself a nice dinner. 30 bucks. Don't bother. I did mention this though in the free gems video. But you can definitely get free Google Play credits. If you play this game on an Android. I'm playing it on a Pixel. But any Android with access to the Google Play Store. There's an app called the Google, I'm not sure exactly what it's called. I believe it's called the Google Reward app, Google Survey, Google, Google Rewards, something like that, where, as I've mentioned, you do get money for taking surveys and just answering brief questions about a lot of its location history. Um... Stuff like that. So obviously, if you if you're not if you're scared of you know companies getting your data, all that jazz, don't do it because they're gonna they're gonna know exactly everything you do. So from a privacy perspective, probably not the best. You're selling yourself out, but at least you're selling yourself out for some money. <laughs> they're paying you like 10, 20 cents each. It does add up. You can save up $10, $15 over the course of a couple months to a year. So use that to get gems, extra gems, extra coins if you want. That's what I've done a little bit. But yeah, you know, sadly, outside of competing those, completing those free gem offers, there's no shortcut really. It's just one of those things where you just have to play the game. Um, as I much as much as I hate to say it, I wish maybe they will introduce better rewards or I would like to see you know like a holiday theme, special rewards like that. But in the current state of the game, you're just not gonna. It's not happening. Um, just got to play, 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 play. At least the game's engaging, keeps you entertained, keeps you on your toes. But yeah, I'm not going to lie. Who doesn't want to want 
an awesome team. I would. I do. I want an awesome team. I, as you see, I still have silvers, players like that. So I'm definitely trying to get those upgraded. But we're doing well for now. Uh, it is getting a little bit harder. So hopefully we're able to win this season still. That's that's the big hope. Big facts. Nobody's sitting up there on second base in center field. Wish it could manually also just set the position of your fielders. That would be cool. You know, get some like troll five guys in the infield. Things like that. But the game's not there yet. We're not there yet. Play us soft. I've seen some of their other games. It's not very inspiring. It's honestly kind of sad. But we're going back to this 100, 117 power. Woo. Not going to get there. Good stuff. Headed to the fourth. Let's see what our boys can do. Nope. We finally do get our 100 power guy, though. Ah, hit by pitch, scores three runs. Okay, okay, get out of here. Dribbler up the middle. Of course the pitcher gets it. Just one of those days. Two outs now. They got Rivera. What was that like? They got Rivera. They got Cabrera. They're ripping off names. What is this? Headed bot fit. Milk Kipper, 117 power. What even are these people? Who knows? But my team sure as heck is does not have a hundred and whatever power. It's fine. Ooh, that was was the strike fastball I was looking for. But we're in one and one now. That is no way that is a strike. You've got to be kidding me. And they're probably going to get me for the double play. <sighs> 100 power guy. This is the first time. Let's see if we can unleash him. Miss. Just off the mark. The two-seamer. Right on. The money. We just need to get his speed up. Nice. Awesome. Drop that in. Very cool. Very cool and very legal. Two to three. It's a comeback. We're not like the Astros. Speaking of baseball, yeah. We are not like the Astros. We are not getting blown out. No 10-2. to 2. We win our World Championship, World Series games. Ah, uh, drop. Nah, he's going to get over. For that third out, going to the bottom of the sixth inning now. Score two. Uh, can never trust those sneaky, sneaky pitchers. Can't trust them. They ain't good. We're going to float one over down the line. Going to get a base hit with one on. Tying run is officially on deck. All that contact can't convert. No, straight to him once again. That's not what we are looking for. Give my offense a chance. Straight to him once again. Oof. I'm really feeling the heat. Feeling the heat. 
straight to him. That's like four times in a row now. We're just going to title this video, Hitting the Ball to Their Center Fielder. 100 power. First home run with the 100 power man. 428 feet. It's not over till it's over. We can mount a comeback. Yep, take your pitcher out. You don't need him. Whew. Okay. Got me a little a little shook there. Back to back. This time down the right field line. 360 feet. Three for four. This guy's carrying me. Let's go. Back to back to back. Ah, uh, I thought it was, it was a good attempt. It was a valiant effort there. We're going to try to give our team a chance. Not a, no, not let up, excuse me, any more runs with the 98 power, my friend. Power curves are scary. Oh, oh, he can get there. Foul ball caught for the out. Second out. Yeah, let's switch them. Why not? Why not? Not going to swing at the screwball. Let's go. One and two. Not going to go for it. That's fine. It was a ball, but he's still able to convert. Yep, most likely going to get a double out of that. Just got to hold him. No home runs, please. Change up. Hit him with the curve. The one, two. Let's get him to swing at something. Mike Trout clean that up. Headed into the bottom. Top of the ninth, excuse me. We're down one. I'm going to say screw it. We're going to go home run fishing. Bounce that foul. 0-2 now. I'm going to be a little bit more conservative. Ah, and I shanked it. Shanked it high. Unfortunate. Oh, boy. I'm trying to power hit without my power hitters, and it's not working. It's not going very well. <laughs> it triples it up. Uh, note to self, uh, let the power guys do what they're good at. We're not able to complete the comeback, even though we hit back-to-back -back home runs. That was epic. Can't pull it off, though. We'll see you... Uh, Next time, we fall into third place in the league now. Two and two. Thanks for watching. Like the video. Stay subscribed. Comment down below any other suggestions. Sorry we missed out on Challenge Tuesday this week. Always taking a look for suggestions for that. And peace out.